But first, the Rangers' home opener with 40,000 fans today is viewed by area businesses as a grand slam. Our Steve Pickett with more on how the economic hopes for small business operators near Globe Life Field. In baseball terms, this opening day is as thrilling as a walk-off homer in the bottom of the ninth when you're a business waiting for a chance to bat. At Jay Gilligan's, an Arlington restaurant and bar for four decades, a Rangers game day crowd is expected, but today it is an affirmation, an economic reinforcement after a year like none other. Customers, those heading to today's Rangers game, said as much. We need this. We need this badly. The, the, the financial almost devastation across North Texas, uh, the, the amount of small businesses, locally owned businesses that have closed uh, due to this, the, this is going to be a shot in the arm. And but the first full house allowed since the COVID pandemic, retail, restaurants and bars near Globe Life Field face their first back to normal game day crowds in over a year. Bar owner Randy Ford said his establishment still maintains all protocols to avoid COVID spread. But having customers back on game day is a shot in the arm so many businesses need it. We're already seeing people we would never see on a Monday lunch. You know, all these folks out here, we've got a few folks behind us here. So it is the opening. It is the opening of not only the Ranger, but for the economy of Arlington, Texas. The next phase for so many of these businesses in Arlington, finding out if this full house today has any kind of negative impact, a possible super spreader event that could impact these businesses in the weeks to come. In Arlington, Steve Pickett, CBS 11 News.